Climate change is devastating forests around the world. And the future sustainability of our forests to support societal needs rise on the ability to harness innovations for improving the adaptation. As a society, we need our trees, not only to provide the ecosystem services that it has, but also we rely on it intimately for our everyday lives. So it is imperative that we do everything that we can to protect our natural resources because the future sustainability of humanity demands it. What we are doing today have long-lasting implications on the future generations of our society and the future sustainability of our environment. Trico is an NC State University startup company that combines genome editing with the power of tree genetics. Trico is an innovative startup company combining the power of genome editing with insights from tree genetics to breed a more sustainable forest. And bringing CRISPR to forestry will allow us to breed more efficiently at speed and at scale the very best genotypes for forests throughout the world in species of commercial interest and environmental interest. In terms of natural resources, our ability to harness wood as a sustainable green material to replace petroleum and plastic must be improved. CRISPR as a molecular scalpel can mutate the genome in ways that are controlled, in ways that are precise, in ways that are predictable, and in ways that minimizes the risks compared to the conventional mutagenic processes. At Trico, we use powerful genome editing technology to change the DNA sequence and induce mutagenesis in forest trees of commercial interest. CRISPR is a technology that allows us to target DNA specifically and induce mutagenesis at a very precise location in the genome to turn on, off, up, or down genes of interest and generate in a non-GMO way novel trees that replicate natural processes that allow us to breed a more sustainable forest. CRISPR allows us in a non-GM manner to induce mutagenesis that replicates what happens in nature and breed the best, most efficient natural genotypes to make more sustainable trees, be it pest resilience, environmental resilience, or traits of industrial interest that enable more sustainable forestry. So at Trico, we spend a lot of time developing a very powerful toolbox to do genome editing efficiently affordably and scalably. We've also developed a very powerful set of knowledge about tree genetics and what genes should we target, what genotypes matter to make sure that we have environmental resilience, pest resilience, climate resilience, at a time that we can also maintain operational efficiencies. Trico is uniquely positioned to democratize CRISPR in forestry because over the years we have assembled all the necessary ingredients to make CRISPR work in trees. We have genetic insights in trees that took us years and years of fundamental research. We have the most advanced CRISPR machinery that has been validated in trees. And importantly, we have the partnerships, we have the expertise, and we have the diverse set of skill sets that can allow us to mutate genes in a very precise manner and characterize and understand the consequence of those mutations, not only in the laboratory, but in the greenhouse and in research field trials. We've actually already translated our work in the lab to work in the greenhouse. And just this year in 2024, we had the great privilege to plant for the first time ever a field trial with edited trees. And this is ushering in a new era of forestry, not just here, but for the whole world. Trico is looking for partners that share our long-term aspirations for responsible forest stewardship. A partner that allows us to harness cutting-edge innovations and technologies to de-bottleneck the current barriers in tree improvement. Trico is very well positioned to deploy CRISPR in forestry because we have a combination of technology, expertise, know-how, passion, and commitment to tackle the greatest challenges that we have on the planet, to breed better trees that will provide solutions in industry, solutions in products, and solutions for the customers and regulators that we need. The next decade is critical. We are at a tipping point to where, if we do the right thing, we could significantly enhance the adaptation and the health and the viability of a national forest. In doing so, combat 
the rapidly changing climate and allow us to harness the power of this largest carbon sink on Earth to meet the requirements and demands of the growing population. What we're trying to do is very hard. We need people to understand how dire the situation is that we're in right now. We need people to share our sense of urgency so we can, at speed and at scale, breed more sustainable forests. We all have to play a part in this because the future health and sustainability of a forest means the future health and sustainability of society by large.